Hey everybody, Coach Duality here with another 2v2 replay analysis, and this time we're here with Apathetic, so let's go ahead and get into this. Good return from your teammate there. Yeah, so this is a good attempt. Um, what's throwing you up here is that you're you're still not taking your line to where the ball is going to be. Um, you're kind of initially pointing yourself straight up so that when you do hit it, um, you kind of get a softer touch from the side. But if you want initially a little bit more to the right where it's going to be, you can get um, a little bit more power on that. touch. Trouble getting up for that challenge. Um, I want to see why you dodged here. Okay, I think it was... I think it actually ended up being a side dodge. Uh, yeah, that's why you're getting no power on it. You're kind of like dodging your car around the ball there. Yeah, you should have been going for that ball there. Um, I want to see if there's any way... Yeah, I mean, you can't tell where your teammate is, so I mean, I might just flick on reverse cam or something, but with this ball going over there, um, there's no reason for you to turn back to the other corner. You want to make sure that you're following that ball, so you're keeping pressure on it. Job getting there to challenge him. Um, not too aggressively there. Yeah, kind of. Um, there's a lot of things you can do with that, so it is important that you get uh, give yourself a little bit of height. So. Okay, there. Yeah, it seems like you're still side dodging into into your shots instead of powering through it. Yeah, you can still, um, you know, get the angle that you want by just playing the, uh, playing the side or edge of the ball there. Yeah, that's a pretty dangerous spot for everyone. Um... You do get away from RT here to get on that and challenge, um, but taking this line is pretty risky because you're committing both of yourself here to that part of the pitch and you see how dangerous that can be. I might just stay a little bit more around the um, midfield and work your line from there. That way you can um, both cover more space. Uh, you're just hesitating too much there. Um, 
This is dangerous, yes, but basically from this point you need you need to just immediately pick a line and take it in the air. The longer you stay on the ground like this with that distance, the um the more time and opportunity he has to get some height on that touch over you. It's too hard to react to it. You just gotta basically just, you know, muscle up and get into it. from over zero there. Um, I can see all that choked you up. I'm trying to see if there's any other way you could have played this. Um, so I think what's rough here is that you're crossing too far back over. Um, like you know that shot's coming on, um, but you do end up taking too far of a line over. I mean, I'm not gonna say you base like you played it wrong because you basically have to try to cover all of the net there. Throwing all of your momentum in the wrong way here, especially with that um, little spurt of boost. Basically, like, when RT is looking at this ball and getting ready to challenge, you definitely want to give yourself a little bit more distance. So, I would just, you know, turn your car around, get back to sort of around the net, and turn around to look at it. Because here, you leave a pretty big, um, like, dead zone behind you. And you like force yourself to get up awkwardly backwards, whereas if you were just back farther in the first place, you would have had more room and time to understand where the ball is coming and react to it with a little bit less panic. Going for a shot is kind of risky there. Um, Artie's pretty far away, so it does make a pass um, definitely difficult to try to pull off. And I think you're too far under this when you make your touch. So you end up touching it with the side. If you gave yourself just a little bit more space before you dodged into it, you would have got the, um, the front of your car, so produce more power. this. That's a really nice save there. Good patience on not going up too far with him here. I don't know why your teammate is touching that. He should be leaving that for you. too early there from the wall. Alright, um, well GG's here. Uh, pathetic. Uh, thanks for sending this in. Be sure to leave a like if this helped you out at all. And I will be seeing you guys around, so thanks.